I'll leave you to it. When they finally meet, uh, it's a really, it's a really interesting, beautifully written scene. I don't think he had any idea he would ever return. I know family reunions for everyone are very awkward. Everybody has the drunk uncle or the mean grandmother or whatever it is. I don't know your life, but uh, let's just say the Lannisters uh, are a complicated bunch. I needed to see you. And I knew you'd never agree to meet. He doesn't know what to expect, really. He doesn't expect uh, a warm welcome, that's for sure. I thought I'd surprise you by hitting Gosterly Rock. Father would have been proud. Don't talk about father. He used to trust his brother. And I think deep down he still does, but um, even his brother betrayed him. He feels like he betrayed him because of, you know, he killed his father. Listen to I me. I once told Bron that if I ever saw you again, I'd cut you in half. For me, it's always the, the, the intimate story, the, the character story, what links these people. Um, and uh, the bond between those two brothers is, is, is so strong. It'll take you a while with a sparring sword. It's this uh, very complicated thing of he's really looking forward to seeing him. And because uh, he still loves him. He was going to execute me. He didn't hate me because of anything I did. He hated me because of what I am. It's at the very core of who they are as Lancer. They've been raised, they've lived in this, this bubble that the most important thing is your family. You know, you, even if you, have, if you have fights within the family, you still, you know, you're loyal. And for the Tyrion to just, just jump ship and go straight to, to the, the enemy of all enemies. Did he think I wanted to be born this way? Did he think I chose? What do you want? Daenerys will win this war. You're a military man. You must know there's no way around that. The loyalty to, to Jaime is still really strong. It shows a lot about loyalty and how you sort of, how it manifests. 